Here is the dice mold that I am going to try and make some gummies with. I got this on Amazon, it was like $13. I got this at Walmart, it was like $8 maybe. Uh, here's the instructions on the back. So the first thing is you take out the gelatin packet and you add it to like three quarter cup of water and which didn't seem like enough water, but it instantly started like solidifying and you mix it and it becomes thick, like instantly. So you can see I'm struggling here. So here I am, with two hands. So as the gelatin blooms, it has to sit for five minutes. So now I'm adding the rest of the mixture and it was a quarter cup of water, which didn't seem like enough, but you have to bring it to a simmer. And I began mixing it with a whisk and realized that was a poor choice. So here I am regretting that decision. And then as it kind of thickens, I realized I didn't have any flavoring. So I decided to just try some vanilla because that's all I had in hand, as well as some food coloring. So I added in the gelatin once it boiled. It was really sticky and gloppy mess and it looked horrible. So here I added the blue food coloring to it. And then I poured it into the mold originally like this. this. Is how I do it when I make ice and realize that wasn't gonna work. So I took the top off and we're just gonna do halves to see if this will work at all. And it was basically solidifying as I was pouring, even though I had it really warm. So it was kind of tricky to work with. And the blue actually made it look green. I probably should have added more food coloring. But I just filled in all the dice molds just to see if it would set. And there it is. I have them all set. I also made some gummy worms for my daughter. And so after six hours, here are the gummies. They came out of the mold really easily. And honestly, I like the detail of the numbers, even though it was only half the mold. So here they are up close. And I gave them a try and it was pretty thick gelatin. I mean, it was edible, but I'd like to try it with other flavors besides vanilla. So overall, I'm pretty pleased.